I'm Brienne. And I'm Maxwell. Welcome, Welcome to, to Seriously, Seriously Sorta Serial. Serial. Because the DeMarcos work from the same place where we live, we're staying home and staying safe while continuing to make awesome episodes for all of you. Once you finish the episode, you can head over to our website and even comment on our Saturday blog. You can find that right here. Do you prefer your cereal dry? Then you're a snacker, like Bowler. Or do you prefer with milk? Then you're a spooner, like Spoony. Today's cereal is... Cinnamon Toast Crunch Treats. Interesting. Looks very carnally. Mm. I actually don't like that. <laughs> Okay, so cinnamon toast crunch treats. Like Rice Krispie treats? Is that what they're going for? Yeah, I guess so. But I mean, in the shape of a granola bar. Yes. A very small granola bar. <laughs> now, we recently tried uh, the Lucky Charms treats, mm -hmm. and they look very different on the box, but this if the last one is anything to go by, this looks about what the what the last one was. It's little, it's some pieces of the cereal, but mostly it looks like like rice, like rice crispy, <laughs> like rice crispy treats. Actually, no, no, not really the same. No? Oh, <laughs> yeah. Oh. So. Oh. <laughs> this is Never what mind. it looks like. I'm gonna try to give it to you guys here. Oh. Hopefully that is showing and not just a giant blur. Um, it kinda looks sloppy. Yeah, it's not the prettiest thing I've ever seen. Yeah. Um, you can't really tell that it's cereal to be honest. I mean, it doesn't look like cereal to me. No, it doesn't. It just, I don't know, it looks like generic kind of smushy granola yeah, bar. Yeah, it looks like or, like, like, or like some sort of nougat. Not quite as squishy as like a cliff bar. You oh, know how those are just yeah. kind of like a mound oh, of yeah, like are, oat and stuff? Yeah. Um, not, I don't care for those that much. Yeah, the texture is weird on those. Um, not quite as much as that, but the top kind of reminds me of that. Like, it's very yeah. smushy looking. You know what actually what this reminds me of? And sort of a Lucky Charles one too. Hmm. This one in particular though, this reminds me of the Oatmeal Raisin Luna Bars. They have the same, their mm. frosting is also kind of like patchy. And yeah. like this sort of treat reminds me of the Luna Bars overall. Yeah, I mean, the, so the one thing that I'll give them is this, it, it's, it doesn't look like the what's on the box, no. but it is a lot closer than the Lucky Charm one that we had tried. Yeah. So I will give it that. Um, yeah. Is that Crazy Square Surfing? I think so. This one? I think it's surfing. Yeah, it's... What's I'm happening, sure. to, what's happening to this here. one, though? So it doesn't melt. It's like swimming in the box. Like in this thin white line, it's swimming in the box. Interesting. It's I think that's supposed to be milk. I guess so, yeah. But there's not a lot of contrast between the box color, which is the palest beige you could imagine. <laughs> yeah. Only one shade darker than the white. Yeah, it just <laughs> makes it seem like... Which I think is the milk. It just makes it seem like like the crazy squares are warping reality, <laughs> which yeah. is not that far out for that, to be honest. It doesn't make a lot of sense, but yeah, the the I think it's the primarily the texture of the bars is completely different than what they show on here. Yeah, um, it's very compact, and this is all like light and airy, and like there's yeah. The, well, texture. that's sure. Yeah, it's that's what I mean. That's what the Swiss sort of thing does. They always try to make it look homemade, or like yeah, homemade or whatever. But yeah, yeah. It's, it's I mean, I get that the pictures that they take from the box have to look really good, and it's usually not the actual product. Yeah. Like sometimes for ice cream, they use mashed potatoes. That's true. So that's that it doesn't true. melt, which is bizarre. So likely, if you've seen a picture on ice cream of ice cream, it's not ice cream. Mind blown. Yeah. When I, you know, when I was younger, I was, I was like, how do, you, how do they get those good scoops? And it turns out they don't. They don't. <laughs> it's potatoes. <laughs> Mashed potato ice cream with gravy. But one thing that I will give them is when I was holding the bar, I could tell it smelled really good. Mm. Okay. So I don't know. Shall we dive in? Yes. Mm -hmm. Let's do it. All right. 
I'm just thinking of mashed potato ice cream. One thing I noticed about the box was that it had like some sort of like caramel like stretched between the two pieces. I know that's just like for sure, but I'm wondering mm -hmm. if it's like a caramel taste to these. Mm -hmm. Not really. Ugh. No, not very caramely. Hmm. Not very cinnamon y evil after me. Yeah, I think it is. Does it taste like cinnamon toast crunch? No. I am getting a bit of that cinnamon flavor though now. Mm. But it's it is less. Yeah. And for cinnamon toast crunch, that is not warming. Mm -hmm. They do that very well. I'm just not sure what I think about this. I think I like it. Hmm. It's very sticky. Yeah, these are very messy, so that's yeah. something to keep in mind. If you're trying to keep clean and you don't have a napkin or a tissue or something with you, just be aware, they are messy. The, um, the frosting stuff they have on the bottom melts super fast. Like if your finger touches it, it's gonna melt. I guess unless it's winter and you're outdoors. They taste, I guess they can taste <laughs> kind of like it, but yeah. it is only, it's only now at the end where I'm kind of getting like that cinnamon taste. Mm-hmm. And then, Like there's some other flavors in there that yeah. I feel like are added that are part of something. I'm not yeah. sure if it's the frosting or whatever this is that's keeping it together. Yeah, the I guess sticky. that's what, what they like showed is like the caramel yeah. stuff on the box. The, Hmm. Yeah, maybe, maybe it's like molasses. Yeah, something like that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But, uh, yeah, I mean... <clears throat> yeah, I think I do like them. I think the other thing about these is that since, very, since I usually have cinnamon toast crunch with milk, it kind of maintains some of that grittiness, mm. which I don't really care for. I'm not really a snacker in terms of cinnamon toast crunch. It's just mm -hmm. a little too messy for me. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, I don't know about that. I, I, just, I think if I had to choose between the two, I might go with the Lucky Charm one. Really? Yeah, I think so. Hmm. I don't know. I'm, I'm a little iffy. I think I'd say the opposite. I think I like this better. I feel like it actually has some flavor. Yeah. The Lucky Charms, I... I don't know where the flavor went. <laughs> it's interesting, though. I think that's really interesting. I'm a little iffy on this one, actually. Hmm. Hmm. I don't know. I feel like the Lucky Charms ones were too sweet, but these I, were really but sweet these too. These were a little bit. I I don't. I really didn't like the grittiness. The texture was mm. just kind of weird for me. Yeah. And it did seem a little like more sticky. Not gonna lie. Like maybe it was like the extra icing on the bottom, but, but like it seemed like it got sticky like quicker. Hmm. That's interesting. I am going to. I think I'm gonna give this a two out of five. Oh. Yeah, I didn't care for this. And also, it did, it also it took a while for you to actually get the taste of Cinnamon Toast Crunch. So you mm -hmm. had, like, the grittiness, but you didn't even have, like, the actual delicious flavor to, you know, balance it out. Yeah. So. It seemed like it wasn't until, like, the second half of the cereal bar. Not cereal bar, sorry. Treat bar. Yeah. Treat bar. Yeah, I mean, they like are, the... like, a dessert thing, I'd say. That's, that's, yeah. that's consistent with both of these. Definitely. Yeah. Like... Maybe good in a lunch? Yeah. For like a dessert sure, option instead sure. of like a hostess cupcake or yeah, something? Yeah, but like I'd say with this one, you'd like need a drink. Oh yeah. Like, I feel like I need a drink. Like I want a glass of milk or milk sounds best to be honest to yeah. kind of cut that sweetness. Mm -hmm. Like after you have a cookie or a piece of cake or yeah, something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, definitely very dessert, dessert -y. But yeah, I mean, and... For me, it wasn't literally until I'd had the last bite and the taste was just kind of sitting in my mouth that I actually got any sort of semblance of a flavor. I was like, oh yeah, there it is. 
Like, it was after the fact. I hate to keep saying aftertaste, but it really was more of an aftertaste for the actual mm-hmm. flavor, you know? Yeah. It was like a hint of the original. That I don't know. It, I mean, both of these, I don't think, really have anything aren't that similar to what they're based on, but at least mm-hmm. with the other one, it was kind of like, okay, I could eat, I could see this as a little sweet bar. Mm-hmm. This one, gotcha. this one was just, yeah. this one, I feel like I'd get tired of very quickly. I think I like this one. Okay. I feel confused about it. I Like I think it was good, but it was strange. It's like when you have a brand of something that you've never had that version and you're like, "Okay." Yeah. Different, but not bad. Just yeah. Strange. I think I liked it. I think I give it a three out of five. So I think literally we've flipped yeah. our scores from our last yeah. cereal treat bar. Um, yeah, I, it's just really strange. Mm-hmm. It's really sweet. It's not bad. It's certainly not no, bad. I not. Um, I mean, in my in my opinion. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <clears throat> um. I mean, I would have just thought it was like inedible. I just say it. I think I get. And I don't disagree with anything that you said about it. And I think that's why I'm like, do I like it? Like, I I think I did like it, but at the same time, I totally agree with you. Yeah. So. Like, yeah. it has serious flaws. There are issues. <laughs> so yeah, middle middle of the road. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I guess so. I mean, I don't know. Give these t- give these a try. You know. Yeah. Buy buy one of each, like a little small pack. See which see which you prefer. And they were really inexpensive. Yeah, that's. True. I think it's like sixteen bars, and I think we got them on sale for one ninety nine, but they're normally two ninety nine. So very inexpensive. And I think that's you know, if you have a sweet tooth and you like cereal, give them a try. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> have you tried the cereal? What did you think of it? Find out more about Seriously Serial at our website. Thanks Thanks for for watching. watching.